All right, my friends, we got the new patch notes out here today for the November 6 update notice, and we're going to break it all down for you here in today's episode. Thank you for tuning in. As always, if you enjoy, make sure to like and subscribe on top of that. If you got a question, if you got a comment, let me know because I love to hear from you as always. And would love to see you in our amazing community and Discord server, my friends. Now, down below, you can find all the great information in today's uh, uh, <laughs> description um, and details along with the timestamp. So let's get into it here today as we break down the November 6th update notice, my friends. Hello and welcome to the Cookie Run Kingdom here. A new update is coming November 6th, two days. Yes, very, very quick. We'll mark the start of an even more exciting beast raid. That's right. Let's go on an adventure with frilled jellyfish cookies, new magic candy, and costume as well. So what is new? First and foremost, we do have the Beast Raid Avatar of Ruin Master Difficulty being unlocked here. The Avatar of Ruin is here, clad in armor and armed with the power of destruction. Challenge yourself in the Beast Raid Master Difficulty and claim your victory. Beast Raid Master Difficulty will be available. Unlock Master by clearing Expert. So if you haven't cleared Expert so far, we've got a number of different guides here on the channel that you you can check out in order to help you get by and do that. The boss will gain a new skill in Master and receive reduced crit damage. So very important there because our strategy is going to shift and change and adjust. Additionally here, uh, the boss's attack in hard difficulty has been rebalanced for better strategic play. So keep that in mind as well. There might be some different stuff there that could happen. So take advantage today of getting by expert while you can just in case it changes, my friends. All right, next we got the Oink Turmeric Boar here, my friends, pretty sweet. Check it out, defeat the giant turmeric boar and claim some awesome rewards. Use random effects and upgrade effects to deal damage to turmeric boar within a limited time frame. You can lock up to three random effects. All right, we love this. Purchase cookie skills in the new effect shop to defeat turmeric boar and get high scores. You can purchase tactical skills or cookie skills in the effects shop. Cookie skills are activated at regular intervals and exclude uh, buffs applied to self. You get five free refreshes and it will be refilled after playing the battle mode. Clear missions that claim two types of event rewards, which can be upgraded and used in the effects shop and shop. This one's a super, super fun one. We've done a ton of these events where we up here collect our three different unique uh, bonus effects for our team. Lots of different strategies, these things as well. Um, so stay tuned, like, and subscribe for new content here as always for the turmeric boar, my friends. We've got some older episodes and guides around these things that you can check out here on the channel as well. Additionally here, we have the Town Square Bell of Glory, my friends. So ring the Bell of Glory to help out cookies in the Town Square. A new Bell of Glory system will be added in the Town Square. Ring the Bell and give buffs to everyone in the Town Square. You will need certain items to ring the Bell of Glory. Obtain items by completing the following events and missions. Claim the Horn of Ruin for clearing Beast Raid on Master with a low probability or completing the Clear Beast Raid on Master times three mission in the Beast Raid event. Claim the whole Horn of Ruin as a rank reward in Beast Raid Avatar of Ruin. Claim the Guardian Sword in Cookie Alliance on Hero Difficulty with a low probability. Claim the Guardian's Blade as a ranking reward in Cookie Alliance. Claim the Victor's Token as a rank reward in Arena. Visit the Lion Fountain in the Town Square to select and use one of these items. Using an item will ring the Bell of Glory, granting limited buffs to all players in the town square. Different items will provide different buffs. Here, Horn of Rune, we got Beast Yeast, World Exploration, Juicy Stamina Jellies, minus 30% for five hours. Whole Horn of Rune, Beast Yeast, World Exploration, Beast Gear Rewards, plus 100%. Five hours. Guardian Sword, Beast Yeast, World Exploration, Bites, Rewards, plus 30% for five hours. Guardian's Blade, Crispia, World Exploration, Topping Pieces, plus 30%, five hours. Victor's Token, Beast Yeast, World Exploration, Beast Get Dope, plus 30%, five hours. You can ring the glory, Bell of Glory again 30 seconds after it has been wrong. Pretty awesome. I really, really like seeing this world bonus event situation now with the Bell of Glory. I think this is a great idea and something unique and new in Cookie Run. So excited about this, and I think we're gonna have a good time. I see a lot of different cool applications for this. I like how it's PVE focused right now, so it's not specific to like additional crit damage or additional cooldown where you got to calculate those things in your cookies. This is really, really nice, and not only that, it gives us like half a day 
uh, well, really five hours in terms of getting through those things, maybe a quarter of a day, right? Um, which is pretty sweet. Now, additionally here, my friends, we got a new magic candy here with the frilled jellyfish. Super excited about this. We're gonna have some fun with this one for sure. Check out frilled jellyfishes, cookies, new magic candy, snare of the deep. Awesome. Here's the skill description. We got frilled jellyfish cookie shackles more enemies with even more power. You upon using her skill, she shackles up to 20 enemies, targets cookies first, wither tentacles, inflicting crit damage debuff and extra seafoam damage. Additionally, when frilled jellyfish cookie burrows in the ground, she will grant crit percent buff for the team as well. And we can't forget, my friends, we do have the new jellyfish jellyfish cookie costume pretty awesome gonna have to go out and check that one out it is an epic costume called friendly hotel mate additionally here my friends we do have the new guest young colfi many of you have asked me how do i get this so we'll maybe see now anyway with this the outside world is so cool fee meet the new guest young colfi you can meet young colfi in the colfi's gift package uh oh does that mean maybe it's Paywalled? Oh, uh, no, not as a free to play player, my friends, and the number one free to play, as we like to say. All right, that could be very, very unfortunate here. Anyway, stay tuned for more stuff, as always. All right, last but not least here, my friends, we do have the new theme, Gotcha of Fate. So if you watched uh, some of my episodes here recently, if you go into the Gotcha of Fate, you can go down to this lower spot right here. And that's where we're going to click and flip over to the other edition, depending on what it is you're trying to get and pull. The other thing that I do want to say here is if your timer is not running out here in the next two days, you can save these tickets for the new Gotcha of Fate uh, instead if you'd like to do that. So I just want to call that other uh, key tip and trick out there for you when it comes to Gotcha of Fate. All right. So now we're going to have the abundance and destruction theme will be added. Select the new theme to get a chance to obtain Burning Spice Cookie or 12 Soul Prisms of Awakened Golden Cheese Cookie. Um, obtain a destruction and abundance choice chest for every 300 pulls to select and obtain Burning Spice Cookie or 20 Soul Prisms of Awakened Golden Cheese Cookie. The number of draws for each theme is counted separately. All right. So we got a ton of things coming our way my friends here in the latest and greatest update super excited here again we got beast raid master mode we got the turmeric boar boss uh event we got the town square bell of glory the new magic candy costumes kofi and gotcha of fate if you have a question or comment about today's episode certainly please let me know we've discussed a lot of things here give me some good tips and tricks as we move into this new one here for you today as well with that, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for tuning in. As always, I appreciate your support. Thank you for the likes and the subs, and thank you to our members. We do have memberships available to us or to you down below, along with my affiliate links, and don't forget our lovely Swag and Merch store. Um, don't forget my socials, at me, chat me, stay connected, my friends. Like I said, drop a comment. Join us in the Discord. We've got a lot of fun in there, as always, too. And stay on the lookout for those live streams, as we like to say. We just did one. Um, it was a lot of fun. So with that, get ready, my friends. And until next time, keep on running.